I just finished my most You know I never use this is not my habit that I don't make people wait wait especially models and today what I did was I invited two models and I did not tell them that there are two models in the studio today and it was a surprise for them when they came they met each other I made them comfortable and I asked them that um, become friends exchange your contacts and maybe we can do the shoot again uh, sometime so well they agreed and they uh, did not mind otherwise <laughs> I have so much to say <laughs> I don't wanna you know hmm. so we had a good shoot the problem is that I don't want I don't make models wait and it was a kind of a bad kind of a bad a little bit a decision that it was not a product shoot. In product shoot, you know, one model goes, they change the clothes, and in the while, I, I can shoot the, the first model. But here, it was a lingerie, boudoir shoot, uh, burlesque. And the problem was that <laughs> there were no clothes, actually. But, um, and there was no changing of clothes because there were only two lingeries or you can say uh, clothes whatever <laughs> so the model was keep on waiting the first and then the second while I, I was shooting one the second was waiting when I was shooting the second the first was waiting and this is not what I like and but the positive of it, of it this is the second one was um, a bit nervous in the first, but the first one was confident and uh, maybe had experience. So after looking, uh, after, you know, looking at observing the first one, the second one became more comfortable and confident. And by the end of the shoot, both gave 100% and maybe I'll show the pictures so you can better understand. So, it's never a good idea when one model is waiting, waiting for the photographer and the photographer is taking pictures of the first model and the second model is just waiting, waiting and it doesn't make sense. But the problem is that I paid for the studio and I paid for the extra light, I paid for like each and everything myself, but uh, I didn't want to make reservation twice. But another positive point is that I shoot, I. Uh, shot both of them together together as well so uh, this is just uh, something I experienced in my life first time and thought I should share it with you and uh, what else I was running like crazy Ah, I forgot, 64 GB of my memory card, it was full in like 45 minutes. I took like more than 1500 photos or maybe 2000, I don't know, yeah. But again, when I was transferring the photos to empty the memory card, again the models were waiting, looking at me, I asked them 5 minutes, but it took like 10 minutes. Thank God I had my MacBook with me. I uh, transferred the photos because I played. I was playing the music on the laptop. So the memory card finished. These are the blunders which I made today, which should not be, you know, which which should be abstained from. So this is uh, the office and. Uh, it's what time is it sunday 10 15 20th november okay but this was my most um, creative intuitive strategic fantastic um, most uh, engaging most challenging most 
mm, persuasive and uh, you can say surprising shoot I would say yeah and I asked for the feedback after the shoot from them that what is your feedback for me as a photographer for my improvement always I do that one of them said that you are fast of course the people who know me that they know that I am fast in photography business uh, taking photos and with the camera and uh, he, she said that uh, you got the good shots she trust that uh, I but she bet I got some good shots and uh, after that uh, like I can't fully remember what she said but uh, she also said that um, she would like to work with me again and that is what keeps me going motivated and that's what makes me feel more positive that okay I she will see me again for the shoot and the second one second one uh, second one was uh, she wanted to take my photo to post on her Instagram that I was with you and we took we did this show today but I was reluctant and I was not comfortable f uh, for I don't take pictures with models and uh, I didn't let her take my picture she was uh, not happy uh, but in the end <laughs> I made her happy how I asked her what is I have feedback for both of you would you like to listen <laughs> so I gave them feedback I said that uh, before in the beginning you were more comfortable and confident and after looking at you you the second one became more confident and uh, in the end we got the best shots and um, they are making Christmas arrangements and I need to leave okay Bye-bye. See you, my love.